Hi, my name is Rich Harrington, and welcome to this episode of Creative Kyle's Video Adrenaline for Premiere Pro. Today, I want to quickly show you how to use the Replace Edit command so you can swap out one take for another. Here's how it works. I've got a shot here, and let's just watch the sequence through. Hey, Joan, I'm Skip, and I'll be your doctor today. Notice that he was a little bit late delivering his line, and his energy was a little bit low. So what I want to do is try swapping that for a different take. I'm going to go ahead and highlight that clip in the timeline and move the current time indicator to his word. There's his first word, hey. We'll go ahead and load up another take here. And notice that I can go ahead and find that same word here. I've already set this to view the audio meters. Hey, Joan, I'm Skip. That looks good. We'll move the current time indicator. So it's on the same word. And we can switch that back to composite video. And you see he's delivering his line. He's on frame. He hit his mark. So with that selected, we'll go ahead and control click on the clip here. And we'll choose replace with clip from source monitor match frame. Now this is going to take the clip that's in the source monitor, use the current time indicator both in the sequence and in the source monitor to create a sync point and automatically create the correct in and out points. Let's go ahead and choose that. You see it swaps and all the complex effects here, the cross dissolves, the L cut is all intact. Hey Joan, I'm Skip and I'll be your doctor today. So, perfect edit. The replace edit was a great option there to swap things quickly in and out. You also may find that useful if you've got B-roll shots that you want to swap out. I particularly love it though for swapping in different takes, whether they be narration, on camera, or performance, so I can quickly switch from one to the other without having to pull apart my sequence and then restitch it all back together again. For Creative Kyle, my name is Rich Harrington. Be sure to head on over to creativekyle.net where there's a ton of great tutorials as well as additional podcasts on the site for you to check out. Thanks again.